Hey guys, Jim from Measure Square here. I'm just going to do a quick little video to show off our cal carpet calculator through our website. So I'm here at the moment. You'll see on the screen where it says carpet calculator. So I'm just going to left click on that link. And this is going to take you into the first part where you can enter the actual dimensions of your own rooms at your house. So let's say we already have this one room ready to populate. You can add the room name yourself. So I'm just going to put 14 by 16 for my width and length for our example. And then let's say we have a little bit more odd shaped room, like an L shaped room. I can just go ahead and hit the add L shape. And then this will give me a little bit different menu where I can again rename the room. I can enter those dimensions in manually here like we just did. Or we can do a little bit easier way and just move our mouse to the edges of this L shaped room. And I can just click and drag and we'll see the dimensions change live in those uh, text fields above it. And you'll even see the area change as I move these around. So I can adjust these to the correct size as I need. And then once I'm done there, I can leave it alone. Now let's say we need to add a staircase as well. I can just left click on the add staircase. I can change the width um, of the actual staircase. So let's say I want to change it to three foot six inches for the width. And then I'll just leave the uh, tread and riser alone. And then we have the number of steps we can change to. So let's say I want to change that to 12. And if you're not sure what a tread and riser is, we can literally just click on this link right here, or actually just hover over it. And then you'll see the uh, examples that it's giving. So we know exactly which dimensions from the stairs that you actually need. And then from here, I can easily just click Get Scene Layout and Estimate. And now this is going to use the uh, dimensions we just inputted to give us a carpet layout. So we'll be able to see all the... Uh, dimensions for our actual room on the right side along with the actual amount of product needed of the carpet to go in these rooms. So we'll see the same placement already populating here and then along with these little arrows showing the direction of the carpet of it's actually going when it gets installed. And we'll see our staircase here as well with that carpet uh, on there. Then again we'll see the uh, dimensions down here again for the usage and our net area. So net area is just the size of the rooms themselves. Usage is the actual amount of carpet we'll need um, to fill those areas and then we'll even see our waste ratio down here at the bottom right at 10.74% and then we'll see our cut sheet and this represents where those cuts uh, for the room actually will go on the roll of carpet um, that is needed uh, for this job. Now once you have that done we can actually just go really easily up here at the top type in our email to send this image to so I'm going to put in my email really quick and then from here, I can hit email estimate. And now this is going to shoot me a PDF of this image right here. And that's basically it, guys. Thanks for watching.